Today we had a 2014 E350 towed in with about 79,000 miles and it came in here for a check brake fluid level light. Uh, you can see it's on on the dash, comes on in red. So we went over the reservoir and it looks like it was super low on brake fluid. So we're going to lift this up and show you some common points on where these leak brake fluid. So now we got the vehicle up in the air, we're inspecting the brake lines. Now these brake lines are actually made out of steel, so they rust. So you can see these brake lines are very rusty. But back here, there's no actual leaks. Now these brake lines will probably end up leaking down the road in the rear. Um, but when you come all the way over here, the part that's actually covered is where it's actually leaking. So that's the brake line going from all the way to the front to the rear. And in the middle section, you can see it's leaking. So what we would recommend is replacing the brake lines all the way from the front ABS unit all the way back to the rear and re recommend doing both brake lines. That's the best way to do it. Now when we replace our brake lines, we replace it with the copper nickel brake line. These lines don't rust and they're easy to bend and easy to install. And we install them just like frac deer. You can see this goes right above the fuel tank. So if you follow these lines, they go above the fuel tank. So what we have to do is lower the fuel tank, lower the subframe. That way we can route it like factory. Um, now some people do what I call a splice and dice where they'll cut right here and just fix that little patch. But remember, those rear lines are all rusty and I can promise you up here towards the wheel is also rusted. So it's best to do the whole complete line um, to get you back on the road and making sure that you don't have to pay for another tow bill because that's what this customer had to do. So if you have a Mercedes model year 2008 to 2016, this could be your issue. Your brake lines could be leaking. So if you have that check brake fluid light on or even possibly have a spongy pedal, there could possibly be air in the system due to a pinhole leak in the brake line. So we highly suggest bringing it to a shop that specializes in Mercedes, or you can bring it to the dealership. I will tell you the dealership do charge a lot of money for the brake lines because they use updated steel lines, uh, which can still possibly rust. So if you want to reach out to us, you can reach us at 603mtech.com.